Walter calling in from uh, Lynchburg. Walter, you're on Free Talk Live. Uh, yeah, I appreciate your topic tonight. It uh, made me think a lot. And I was calling about the, just uh, thinking about the cops that you were talking about. And, it, I, you know, I think a lot of things changed because of the family values and that, you know, these days the cop pulls somebody over for speeding. And if they happen to have a warrant, they might shoot them. And, um, and it happens all the time. And I, I think that if we got back to the, if everybody would start getting back to the original family values and everything, then and condemning the people that do this, which doesn't seem to happen, um, that things, all of this would go away. Which family value is going to, uh, you know, to, to fix this? I'm, I'm just trying to figure it out. Well, well, you know, the fact is that um, we were, we were, I was raised in a southern family that, and that we were taught to respect the police and that you respect the grown-ups and parents, and you also respected other people. And the fact is, um, the kids today, you just don't hear it. And, you know, the ones that you see on the street, um, you know, they just don't have a respect for any authority. And that just kind of goes on where they just kind of do. And, and, of course, a lot of them now are even armed. And that's kind of where the situation has gone bad because, um, you know, I... I, I don't know. I would never have ever. I mean, when we went on vacation, um, I just got back from vacation. But when we went on vacation when we were younger, we didn't even lock the house, and we were gone for two weeks. Wow, that's a heck of a you story. Know, you didn't, <laughs> Thanks for you the didn't call, Walter. To... Appreciate that. Um, I'm, there's no doubt in my mind that things are going to go better for you if you use your Sunday manners in dealing with the, with the law. Um, and you probably should lock your door when you go away on vacation. Free Talk Live, seven nights a week from 7 to 10 Eastern, live on the Liberty Radio Network at lrn.fm. 